Summer months are just around the corner. Doctors now are reminding people of the dangers of skin cancer. Monique Griego has more on the unusual places doctors are seeing cancer pop up. Anita Meyer Huber spent years dealing with irritated lips. It was just always looked chapped and it was red and sometimes flaky. But she didn't think she had anything to worry about. Perfect and flawless. Until visiting dermatologist Dr. Noel Sherber. I just thought I had chapped lips. I had no idea that it could be cancer. Anita was diagnosed with actinic colitis or precancerous sun damage of the lips, a condition that's becoming more common. People who used a lot of lip gloss, lipstick, went to the beach a lot when they were teenagers, are now coming into their 40s, and we're seeing a lot of sun damage on the lips. Sherber says many women don't realize lip gloss can increase risks. The shine from which just accentuates UV rays like a reflector. As part of Skin Cancer Awareness Month, she wants to remind people to protect their lips with an SPF, along with sun blocking their bodies. One in five Americans will develop skin cancer in their lifetime. Mm -hmm. And while most people are looking for lesions or black spots... Many skin cancers don't look like that. Sometimes it's a little red area that doesn't heal properly, maybe it bleeds easily, and in Anita's case, it was chapped lips. Precancerous lip damage like Anita's can be treated in a few days with a topical cream. This is her during treatment. And just two weeks later, she was healed. And today, she's just thankful Sherber caught things early. Without her, I mean, it could have gotten a lot worse than it was. Monique Grego, WJZ Eyewitness News. Skin cancer is the most common form of cancer.